right so we're done for now it's frozen snow up in the mountains today it looks beautiful but it's freaking cold windy as well cold and wind combined it's raining hard it's so cold now it's hailing well, maybe a combination of uh, snow and rain. It's that time to turn on my buddy right here. It's freaking cold today. We got snow up the mountains. And uh, that needs to be turned on. I think my uh, dog wants to get warm too. Oh my god, it is so windy tonight, it's ridiculous. After the storm, the sun is out. Peace and love guys. It's frozen. So cold last night, you guys can see we have ice. We have ice last night. Get this one out. It's right on the rocks. Today I'm installing a silt fence um, here in the back so it's around 100 feet uh, 3 feet high so hopefully this is gonna prevent uh, during springtime in summer where um, we're, gonna, we're going to uh, garden and plant some vegetables and protect it from rabbits, rodents, coyotes, foxes and all that. But especially rabbits because they're the one that's eating all the plants here. So it's all good. So this is going to be here in the back area. I'm going to have uh, the pallet fence right there. Or maybe put more silt fence. I'm leaving this area clear. So we'll see. So we can go here in the back a little bit more. Because uh, this is uh, part of our land as well. But if you just take a look here. It's going to protect uh, our chickens as well. Because that's going to go all the way around to the chicken. They're on the side where those pallets are. So that's gonna help. So it's a little experiment of mine. Um, I don't know how well it's gonna do, especially with the wind, but uh, I'm just doing this one for now and monitor that.
right so we're done for now uh, that's at least a hundred feet uh, three feet high a hundred feet wide uh, long so I'm gonna be putting more here uh, if not I'll uh, get some more pallets some old used pallets and uh, continue up to here but I'm gonna get more of those uh, felt put it there more in the back and do the same thing on the other side and perhaps get more pallets so I'll be done so we can make uh, we can do some gardening and we don't have to worry about uh, rabbits and all that and maybe dogs try and get into the property hopefully it's an, a little bit uh, experiment but uh, I'm hoping it's gonna be good got a little bit of water uh, two days of rain not too hard but uh, yeah we got a little bit of water here in the pond I gotta take out those debris right there because it was really windy but uh, I'm probably gonna fill uh, five gallon of water every day or something like that and hopefully that's gonna help fill it up then once it rains some more you got a full pond here here's the inside of the felt fence and this is the outside of the felt fence here's the back here's the other side so I'm gonna leave this open so we can get in like what I said it's gonna go all the way around the chicken coop and uh, it's gonna go all the way here all the way to well probably just all the way here and I'm gonna get more uh, pallets to continue that so it'll be even on the other side as well so it's good and uh, the chickens are okay I checked on them because it was uh, 28 degrees last night I started putting out the fence here on the side now uh, here's the front one on the one side so it's tougher than uh, putting a felt so let's take a look here on the other side I started this one as well I put a total of four uh, pallets so I got more that I need to do so on this one on the side I'll take it slow little by little every day it's just too much work okay guys make sure to subscribe so you can see more gardening videos homesteading videos um, and all that so thank you guys for uh, your support Romy from Solid Gold Shows this is the sunrise this morning